Connor Busick from way out, tucks his shoulder, gets a little closer, bounces one past Troutner and in. Connor Busick scooped up by Denapoli. Denapoli on the run from way out. Van Rapphorst from two. At seven. Brown. It goes. Ryan Brown on the run, back across his body. It's at the X and can cannon and cage. You gotta be perfect. Atlas have the ball again, and it's 5-0 Atlas after the goal from the hometown guy, Eric Law. Power play three for nine on the season, make it four for 10, Connor Busick from two. On the man advantage in their first six games of the year. Redwoods looking for their first of the game, and they get it here. Connection, how good did that one feel? Oh, it feels great. It's always nice playing in Denver, such a good sports town, but we got a lot of work to do here. You know, it's never good going down by this many in the beginning, so we're going to start chipping away. Steal, the clear, the pass from McCardle, and they score! Atlas add to it with six seconds to go in the quarter. Yeah, Eddie Glazner, not really typically known for pushing transition, but they're... It's a race before. But Redwoods team built on D, not necessarily on offense, so... I mean, we are 100% going to see that strategy moving forward, right? We are. New strategy, though, for Redwoods. Stop Connor Busick. The reason, especially for Chrome. Archers have started a couple of different goalies. Troutner can't stop that one from Eric Law. Gets away from Carol Lunas. Busick, the step down, he got it! With Chantel. Yeah, there's uh, face-off responsibilities that are being shared for the Redwoods right now. A Red two shot on the power play. Henningberg, the dive, and he scores. The Redwoods captain scores. Kyle Harrison. Kavanaugh steps down, scores. Low angle there. This is the matchup I've circled if I'm a Redwoods fan. And Henningberg has done it again. But when they see that long outlet, you've got to know. Henningberg, his fourth. And Kavanaugh still with it. He's got Durkin. Kavanaugh to Henningberg. Busick. He scores. Rabel. The dish, a nice spinning reception and finish from McCardle. Doorstep and a goal. Berkovic sheds to Napoli and then he is relieved of the ball. It pop right to Westberg. McCardle wide open on the doorstep. Long enough to get it to Henningberg. Skips it across and Walters puts it in. Henningberg rolling back. Thought about the dive. Little shimmy. And he scores. Defensive exit, but his pass to Buffani was on the ground. And Redwoods take advantage. Things open for Ryder Garnsey. It's now a three goal game. And after a face off violation, the ball belongs to the first place. Whip snakes, and they go right after it. They got Jake. numbers. Jake for Carl for Newman from two. Fixed it up, fixed it up. That's, that's what friends are for. There's a nice play from Ryan Drenner. On Rambo. That game ended on a true Snyder overtime winner as that shot gets through from Rambo. And Fields takes it to the net from a tough angle. Matt Rambo just runs through Newman. And then the dish to Carlson for the finish. Eric Scott. Scott. The dive and the goal. <laughs> Trying to shake free. And as he draws the attention, he finds the cutting Deemer class. Whip Snakes in a two goal game, and Joe Nardella. Taking advantage of that short field as he goes right to the net. Now for Terrain. Terrain turned around. They feed it in tight. And it's Young in transition with an opening for Trenner. Fields sees an opening, takes it, scores. For Michael Earhart. Earhart with a lane right down the middle, kicks it to Trenner, and he buries it. All right, thanks to Jim Stagnita. It's chaos with the ball here. Buchanan. Oh. Took a shoulder 
from Matt Dunn, but the ball still winds up in the Whip Snakes goal. And that's the Miles Jones that Chaos wants to see. Here's Drenner, and the answer is immediate. Week six in D.C. is Deemer Class. Oh. Casually picks the corner past Burnlor. Connor Kelly. He scores. Oh. Able to use that midfield line to his advantage, and that shot goes. Give it away. Hall oh, scores. A gift from Reardon. John Hawes. John Hawes sneaks. Chanachuk. The long one. <laughs> bar down. It's tied. He's <laughs> got a little stutter step on an all star defender in Ty Warner. That one goes. Deemer Class gives Chaos back the lead. The Archers won all the three face offs in the entire game. They lost. They only managed to score eight goals in the process. Connor Farrell, he scores! Six seconds, and the big man goes straight to the net. Jordan Wolf, his shot gets through. And Wolf picks up where he left off. Seven. Fletcher had a huge impact as Christian Cuccinello has him his impact here. Goals. Archer's trying to tie it here. And they do! Bias pass, Tuttle pumps, works it over, and a low shot goes! Yeah, we finally saw Marcus Holman do Marcus Holman things as he got an open look and puts it just under the bar. Give it to Schreiber. Schreiber rolls away from White. Schreiber steps and shoots and scores! And finally give Archers that much needed goal from one of their uh, uh, no, playmakers. Face-off win, not a lot of time, but just enough for Chrome! Now as he turns and looks for an open man, skips it out, shot from McIntosh goes! Goes to his left, he's a... Oh! That's a two-shot from Marcus Holman! In tight, Matthias got it! Cuccinello escapes and scores. Tom Schreiber, he scores. An individual effort from Tom Schreiber. That's the first time today Archers have had a two-goal lead.